Hey you guys and welcome back to Sophia Monet Tarot. It's your girl Sophia Monet. I'm coming back to do your weekly readings and we are on Sagittarius. All right, so, so let's see what Spirit has to say to you for this week. Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's the message for Sagittarius? What do they need to hear and know for this week? Okay, one flew out. Messages for Sagittarius. Hmm. So is something bothering you this week? There could be something bothering you emotionally. And you may be looking to... Almost like you're hoping for the best. But right now, it's like, I don't know if this, this is going to work out. I don't know if this is going to turn in my favor. I'm just not sure. You you feel a little unsure of something. Something is really on your mind. We have shadow, uh, which is like the moon energy in traditional tarot. There could be fears surrounding a certain issue, something that you recently discovered or a truth that came out, a secret that came out. This is bothering you. Mental conflict. Yeah, this is bothering you. You could be uh, holding a secret for someone or keeping a secret of, of some sort and it's bothering you. Victory and success. You're hoping for the best, but you, you don't know the outcome. You don't know how things are going to turn out this week, okay? Yeah, at the bottom of the deck, spiritual strength. So yeah, there's something difficult here that you may have to go through. Look, and you you are aware Okay, that something is very difficult and is going to require a lot out of you. Oh, yes. <laughs> something is going to require a lot out of Sagittarius this week. And you're kind of dreading it. Yeah, split the deck and the seven of swords is here. You may just want to run away from it. Some of you don't want to deal with this headache. With that mental conflict, I feel headache. Like something is a headache. And you don't want to think about it. Why is this energy here for Sag? Why is this energy here for Sagittarius? What's going on with this energy? Why shadow here? Yeah, mental conflict. Victory and success. Yeah. Queen of Cups. You could be dealing with a water sign, a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. Could be in the mix somewhere. Or you could have this in your chart. <clears throat> Five of Swords, you could be dealing with a water sign that's very uh, tricky to deal with. Five of Swords, like someone who could be arguing with you a lot. Four of Cups, it's, it's almost like you want to avoid this situation. You don't want to argue. Three of Wands, you may be a little distant when it comes to this person. This could be a mother figure, uh, a boyfriend, a girlfriend. For some of you, this could be a baby mama, a baby daddy, okay, with that Queen of Cups energy. Um, with Shadow, the Ten of Swords came out. So it's like deep down, you're feeling, it's almost like you're feeling a little defeated, is what I want to say, with that Shadow card. Someone, if it's not you, then put the characters where they go. Someone around you could be feeling defeated, the person that you're dealing with. Someone is feeling hurt or betrayed and they're trying to get over something. There's an ending coming. You could be thinking about ending something with someone. With mental conflict, we have the page of wands. You could want to tell this person like, look, I have a lot on my mind. I'm dealing with a lot and I just don't want to do this anymore. Some of you could be going in another direction uh, definitely with the full energy here to clarify victory and success. Some of you may just choose to go at it alone. Some of you are uh, may feel like you're better off single, um, at least for now. This is just the energy for this week. Some of you may feel or be thinking about just being single and just being on your own and doing your own thing with the full energy. Some of you want to set yourselves free from a headache, or something that's really bothering you, okay? It's like, I don't want to deal with that headache. I don't. <laughs> so yeah, Sagittarius, you're, you're really getting ready to put something to an end with that Ten of Swords, and it may hurt someone a lot. 
someone who's very emotional, um, it may cause a lot of pain for them, but it's almost like I hear you saying, I have to do what's best for me. Alrighty, you guys, so that is your energy for this week, Sagittarius. Don't forget to like this video, give me a thumbs up. Also, share this video and subscribe to my channel, Sophia Monet Tarot. I look forward to hearing from you, Sag. Have a great week. Bye.